Okay, to whitelist any district that you're wanting to have be a part of your Google Classroom, you need to first go to your Google Admin Council. So your administrator will have to do these steps. Um, anyone that's an administrator into your G Suite um, account. So you go to the Google Council the way you normally do. And then um, there's probably a faster way. Um, sometimes I'll just search for whitelist, um, but I'm just going to go to apps. I'm going to go to G Suite Apps, and then I'm going to click on Classroom. When I get to Classroom, um, there's a whole bunch of permissions that you can look into. Um, so you may already have some of these settings created. Um, so you can edit the teacher's permission, anyone in this domain, all pending and verified teachers, verified teachers. This is the easiest one to use, anyone in this domain. Um, because the whitelist is going to take care of that. Um, so let me minimize that and then basically class settings. Um, so I'm going to hit edit on this and this is important. Any G Suite user who can join classes in your domain, who uh, which classes can users in your domain join, join classes in whitelisted domains, so you got to make sure that you save both of those um, to give it a little more um, depth to whomever can join. Um, so that's very important that you under class uh, membership. And then this one is oops, super important, the white listed domains. Um, you can edit them. I'm going to drop them down so you can see. Uh, basically, you just look, put the domain name. So like our domain is nwet.org. So my email is sanders at nwet.org. So whomever you're trying to whitelist, like for instance, Finley City Schools, their usernames are whatever, whatever, at finleycityschools.org. So you're just looking for that last part in their email. So you hit edit and then you hit add new. And all you have to do is enter the uh, whitelisted domain and hit add domain to whitelist. Now the thing about adding a whitelisted domain, they have to do the same things on both ends. So like if if you want me to join your classroom or you want to join my classroom, either way, I have to add you here, you have to add me there. And our domain is nwet.org. So hopefully this helps you get set up to um, whitelist and be able to join other people's uh, classrooms outside your domain. Thank you.